Hey everyone, in this video I'll be showing you how to do topic research using ChatGPT. I think you need a premium version for this, but as an example, let's dive right into my screen and you see my homepage here. And some music, just some fun YouTube videos, this is my personal channel. But let's say I want to make videos for Bible stories. I'm going to keep it very simple. So I type in Bible stories and I'm going just straight to this channel. They have little sound effects, little effects here and there. And what I can do is I can just go to popular. Not everything might be popular anymore, but what I will do is I will go ahead and take a print screen and immediately we will move over to ChatGPT and we will insert this image right here. Very simple. And now we're going to give, of course, ChatGPT a command to work with. So please study the thumbnails and titles of these eight videos. Then I want you to come up, up with eight similar similar titles titles and i want you to make uh tags for the video as well let's do description first similar i don't know how you spell it then i want you to come up with eight similar titles and i want you to come i want you to make a 500 character description of each of each title followed by hashtags related to the title that you have created please and then that's pretty much it that should be fine so now what's going to do is going to analyze it because it's going to this one i study this one and now it's going to give me new stories so here it has a small description and here it has a few hashtags and the hashtags should be related to the title in which case it's not really i have bible truth so how you do titles it's something we're going to discuss when we pretty much go into uploading our first video then i will make all the text for you so you have a perfect example of how that looks like but here it pretty much spits out eight different kinds of titles based on what has already gone viral and that makes it really 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 easy and the small description allows for actually extra search engine optimization, which ensures that the videos rank higher so we have a better performance. And this is really simple, how you can do topic research with this. You can also ask it to give me 10 Bible stories or uh, 10 most read Bible stories. And just by asking such simple questions, we can get, then get to see like, hey, listen, which are the most popular stories that have been read? So Genesis 1, 2, Genesis 6, 9. And you can make complete stories literally from like this small piece of text. You can make a full 40 minute documentary from this. And just literally that easy. And it also shows you Genesis and Genesis. Then it goes to Exodus. Then it goes to Samuel. Then it goes to Daniel. And then Matthew and Luke. And it just goes, does that the whole time. So you have different segments. The sacrifice of Jesus. The betrayal and the crucifixion. Jonah and the whale. They have a lot of different stories. Which you can of course expand. And this is how you pretty much come up with topics. Uh, using ChatGPT. You can do this for anything. You can also do this literally for basketball. As an example hoop flicks. I'll just take a random example that I know. They don't post anymore probably because of license issues so you can literally do the same thing here where you can take a screenshot of the top eight videos you put it into here we're pretty much going to exactly copy the same command and we're going to do the same thing here and we literally paste it again so this is pretty much what it's going to do and i'm curious if it will actually go at most heartbreaking nba moments of the 2024 i would make it uh, most heartbreaking nba moments like just that part is already such a good title i haven't really seen before uh, top 25 top 25 insane plays of stephen curry's career would be possible of stephen curry it would already be good enough so this would make it shorter and more powerful 10 things you didn't know about Janus, I'm not gonna try and pronounce the name, but 10 things you didn't know. Didn't is also a really good title, always. Top 10 things you didn't know about this person. 20, I wouldn't use D before a number in the title. That's really YouTube 2016. I would make it 20 most jaw dropping NBA plays uh, ever recorded or of 2024, just to make it more short and more powerful than NBA players who have escaped death on the court. That's a really good one. You can highly clickbait it with like having like a big gun wound or something this one is really good so it's really easy to actually come up with these topics here you have uh, the mention one one dollar versus 10 million dollar mentions of nba players a little bit like the mr beast style video and then 10 worst files uh, fall calls in NBA history is also a really good one. Uh, once again, I wouldn't use a word before the number, so I would remove that. In this case, I cannot remove it. But 10 worst fall calls in NBA history. And that's simply how I create titles and topics and inspiration for when I want to start a certain niche is I'm just going to brainstorm together with my good old friend, ChatGPT. So of course, if you enjoyed this video, thank you so much for watching. And uh, if you appreciate the stuff that I record out here, if you want to give me a shout out on uh, Twitter or Instagram or any social media, just feel free to tag me if you're watching my videos. So thank you very much and uh, have a blessed day.